Some police departments are struggling to find enough officers, but Greenville says it's getting a lot of interest. Renee Wonderlich met with some people who are looking to apply, and she joins us live. She is at the Greenville County Law Enforcement Center tonight. Renee, good evening. Michael Carroll, tonight was just a first step for folks to see if they have what it takes to become a police officer. Greenville is looking to continue to build a diverse, community-focused police force. But before anyone can put on a badge, they have to get over a few hurdles, literally. This is their opportunity to come and practice the PAT, just get a feel for the course. Candidates from all different walks of life have to run, jump, and drag their way through this physical ability test in under two minutes and six seconds. Okay. The South Carolina Criminal Justice Academy makes all the new officers run this exact same course. So this is um, this is their opportunity to, to see it for the first time, to experience it for the first time. Greenville City's PD held two of these employment workshops yep. so far this year. They sometimes hold up to four. Hiring officers say they typically take about 8% of all who apply. They say they're grateful that compared to some other cities, lots of people seem to want to come to Greenville. Honestly, it was just wanting to test my abilities and skills. I want to apply in December to a couple agencies and so definitely have a chance to train, see how far I go. So what other steps can I be taking to better prepare myself? Now, those who didn't get through the physical fitness portion, that obstacle course you saw, they can take it again in six months. Live in Greenville tonight, Renee Wonderlich, WYFF News 4.